welcome back to my channel. So, I know what you've all been waiting for. Today we are going to r slash memes, the original since 2008, and we will be we will be discussing we will be discussing the epicness of r slash memes and how epic it is. Hit that like button, subscribe, and twerk. Uh, twerk on that notification bell and show your fucking penis to the wall. Actually, that joke is a little weird. Sorry, guys. I don't want to be canceled for the fourth episode. Editor, please may, don't make me look bad, okay? That was such a long intro. Rule 34 is going places. Rule 34. Literally sexualizing a day one. Everybody. Everybody. Everybody be like, what the fuck? 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 This is accurate as F A F. This meme is for virgin soy boys, alright? Virgin soy boys that think they're so better than having sex. And that's probably me. I, I want love too, but. Alright, this is okay, okay, fine. We all want cuddles and hugs and true love. But let's be real here. You also want the girlfriends that way you can fuck. Fucking is great. Look at porn. Porn is amazing. And I mean, sometimes you just want to bang, you know? If, just be honest with yourself. Stop pretending that you're above, you're above better than being whatever. You're on rent for goddamn sake. Don't think you're better, alright? Just. Just pretend you like to fuck and just you want a girlfriend so you can fuck and all that, alright? Come on, calm down, bros. My name's Jed. I don't know if this is- I don't know if he actually was in World War II, but this is so accurate. I can imagine Shrek, like, the, the feeding the Nazis and, you know, basically saving America and saving the United States and you saving the United Nations as a whole. God bless you, Shrek. I love you, and uh, may God, you know, may God bless everybody. Hell yeah. I am a national meme reporter. I am, I have a PhD in memes editor. Please show my PhD of memes right here in this thing, you know. Yeah, just show me carrying this PhD that I totally legit have. All right, very cool. Imagine this absolute chap that built this house diagonally. I mean, respect to you, man. God damn, I wish I had a big penis. Respect to you, man. You are the big jet. You are the one with the big penis, alright? Like, god damn, I wish I had a big penis. Hey, editor, please show that trade offer me. I give you... Shit memes. You like and subscribe. Hmm? Hmm? Yeah, of course, of course. Cause this, that was not funny. I'm dying inside. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm slowly losing it, ma making these videos. I am not happy with society, all right? Society has made me so disgusted that I just want to take a shit in the shower. And one day, one day I'm just gonna like, Sit on the couch and just eat ice cream. Thank you, Big Cat Steve, for the idea. Swedish girls, Spanish girls, Irish girls, good girls, clever girls. That's a clever meme. That's pretty clever. That's pretty good. But I'm not laughing, so it's not a good meme at all. <laughs> Teacher, no making paper airplanes in class. Kids in the back. This paint, this meme is reposted. It's not even funny. I've been single. Okay, okay. For this meme, you can pick one. Choose wisely. Cat girl, she loves you. Bird is bird. I mean, it's, it's, it's an overused meme template. It's not even funny. It's it's that uh, editor. Uh, I, I I know I'm sorry. I'm making you do tons of work, but you know you know the guy that presses a uh, a button, right? The sweaty guy, and he has to press a button, whatever. Um, show that meme, right? That meme template. It's the exact same meme. And I think somebody in the subreddit already made that comparison between the two. So, I mean, I don't know. But yeah, it's just it's just one of those memes. How I, I taught being an adult would feel. How I feel as an adult. 
classy, bro. Like, that's classy, man. That that kid has class. I wish I had class. I wish I had a, I wish I had a talk at and a bottle of and I was like, yes, yes, and my cup of tea, and like, yes, yes, I'm, I'm so, so cool. <laughs> I am just a simple, simpleton, right? I'm just disgusting, I'm just awful, I'm just a smelly asshole that just has no friends. Man, why is he everywhere? Deleted, 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 deleted. Lick my feet. What is my jokes lately? My jokes have been so dark and so cruel. I'm, I've been so savage, like, Honest God, guys, I'm gonna get cancelled one day. And people are gonna look back at these videos and they're gonna be like, man, this kid, this kid is so self-aware and he's so big of a degenerate that he should just go to burn to hell. Her, you, you're my first. Who needs to be gentle? Also her. I mean, <laughs> I don't know, I, I don't know why, but you know, I don't know why sex jokes can be so funny, but they're always so funny. Maybe because I'm a teenager. Teenagers, that's what they like to think about. They, they think about sex all day. That's why they watch porns all day. That's why it's so funny. I have balls. Ha ha ha. Jerking off. Ha <laughs> ha I mean, that's a good meme, bro. That's a good meme. We need to delete a lot of games to make enough space for a new one, but you still know how much you can't just man. You know how much I sacrificed? This meme is so exceptional. Because it's not supposed to be funny. It's supposed to be relatable. And I and that hit me. That hit me so hard. Um as many of you know from the other channel, Austin at YTC, uh not capitalized like this one. Uh, editor put on screen here, uh, image of this right here, whatever, you can, whatever, you know. You know that, um, I like to record things on my phone because my, you know, PC, my laptop at the time, just never had space to do anything, you know, we never had the RAM, I never had, you know what I mean, you know. And I couldn't play a lot of games, I fucking watched YouTube instead, you know, I understood that. And even more, I had Xbox 360, I think that had four gigabytes. Or, or, or was it eight? Um, I don't know. Four, four, eight gigs for 360 games? Oh my god. The Call of Duty demo. It's for what? Black Ops. Right? For the, the original Black Ops uh, demo? Was the entire like storage for the entire 360. All I knew was that when I downloaded the Black Ops demo, it, it didn't even fit. Like, my my 360 was like, nah man, even after you deleted all those games, Black Ops didn't work. So, I could have been a big Call of Duty fan, but fuck you, I guess. When I went to Walmart, right, to buy some hard drives, I don't know why, why I'm going to this tangent, but when I went to Walmart, to buy these hard drives for the 360. I know, it was, it, was, it, was, it was way back in the day. They had Xbox One drives, Xbox One hard drives, and they had uh, 360 drives, right? The 360 drives. And apparently they keep them in the back. They keep the 360 stuff in the back. So what I would do is, I'm like, hey, uh, can, can I see it, bro? You guys see what's in the back? Can I see what's up? And they're like, Oh, you, you want the 360? Holy shit, bro. That's like last generation. I'm like, fuck you, man. I'm a boomer. All right, my parents didn't want to give me the one, so they gave me the 360. And you know what? They made me use for the Connect. So of course they didn't care about the one. But whatever, right? Whatever. So I went, so, so they showed me the price, right? It was $100 for an extra two gigabytes for the 360. Two gigabytes for $100. Nowadays, I can literally just walk to, to Walmart and literally buy a 64 gigabyte hard flash drive and I can get that for like $20. I don't know. I'm so like a d disillusioned. Like, that's so much space. Like, man, society has changed. 
All right, nice to meet you. The Spotify algorithm after I switched from heavy metal to sea shanties. I mean, hey, Michigan State, is that Coraline's dad, right? Bro, I lived in Michigan for about a couple of years. Then I moved to Vietnam, and then here I moved to Texas. And that's where I spent most of my life here, Texas. Texas, but originally, uh, Michigan guy. Brofus, all you Michigan people. Cool. Until I come up with my own thing, I will be using his and Brofus. Uh, you know, in the meantime. <laughs> Employees at the Pringle Company on their way to measure this advertising human fist to make Pringle can size less than that of it. What? This is a great company, they sell tin cans. I mean, I don't like their design. I don't think anybody likes their design, but I mean, it's happening, bro. I mean, the chips are still good and I still like them. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I don't really agree with this, man, but okay. When you pretend to lag out so you can catch the enemy by surprise. Okay. Okay. I don't know if you guys can see this meme or not. The resolution is 1920 by 180, so I really don't know what you guys fucking see, but this meme would never happen in real life, alright? Would never happen. Society isn't that perfect. Where the enemy would let you relax, they would they would chill out, and they would watch you. They would watch you, they would let you get back on, and then they would, you know, resume play. If you were lagging, they would take advantage of it, alright? Has no one has ever played an online game before? You kidding me, bro? Like, if I lag out of a clash royale or whatever, whatever, right? Do you, do you think the opponent's gonna surrender? Like, ah, I'm gonna quit too, right? I'm, I'm an honorable man. I, I wouldn't just, you know, whatever. I wouldn't just let you, uh... I'll, I'll wait until you log back in, and that way we can fight towers again. All right, that was, that's a mobile game, by the way. In case you were wondering, in case, you know, some of you were like, what the fuck is that? Or like Call of Duty, for example, right? Let's play, let's, let's, let's play, uh, let's... Let's say you're playing like players. Let's, fuck. In order to not make fun of me, if you make fun of me, I'll be so upset. Anyway, anyway uh, but like I said, right? Uh, if you're playing like team deathmatch or something, right? If you're like playing like team deathmatch, let's say you're you're winning, right? I'm not sure like usually. When a team deathmatch, like, I don't know, it's like a 5v5, 10v5, 10v10? Let's just say it's 10v10, right? 10v10, whatever. Call of Duty, New Town, right? I forgot what the numbers were. I haven't played Call of Duty in a while. Let's say you were the guy that carried everybody, right? Let's say you carried everybody, you got like 20 kills, you know, you're like, what, 30, 10, right? I don't know, you just, everybody just sucked, you just got two kills each, I don't know. I, I can't do the math here. But let's say you just log out, and or maybe you just lag because your mom just ripped the Wi-Fi, and you just you're arguing with her for like two minutes. You're like, mom, please plug it back in. Mom, for fuck's sake, please, 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 please. And then she, and then she hears you curse, and she's like, what the hell? Why are you cursing, motherfucker? And then she just slaps you in the ass, and then it takes another ten minutes before you're like, oh, okay, I finally got the Wi-Fi, and I'm being grounded out from this game. So you play, so you so you go back in, right? You type, you, you go on PC, you hop in or your console or whatever, right? You go in and then just you know you log back in, right? And oh shit, you're getting kicked out, right? You get you got you got kicked out because you know you're such a loser and uh, you know yeah, Call of Duty just logs you out, whatever. But if you somehow manage to get back in, or somehow the Wi-Fi manages to you know come back on. Bro, you're, you're, you're a sitting duck, bro. You're a sitting duck. And there's no way the enemy is just gonna, ah, there's just some guy sitting there. Let's just, let's just leave him alone. Bullshit, bro. That's, that's when they say bullshit. That's, bro, an AFK person is a free kill. It's a free kill. So, so going back to this meme, when you pretend to lag out so you can catch the enemy by surprise. Nah, bro. They'll take that. They'll take that opportunity to shoot you. And by the time you can just react, you've already been shot in the head. Like, especially if you're like, especially if you're like a sniper, right? If you're a sniper, bro, you see an AFK person? Just move your cursor to the head, bam. How are you gonna pretend to lag? 
bullshit. Utter bullshit. This meme is so garbage. It's, it's not funny, nor is it relatable. Sorry for the way, right? I had no problem, I'm patient. The, the, the nurse, my dad. It's funny, dad pun, I let it slide, let's go on. When you stay alive long enough for the rest of the squad to spawn on you. So this is just another AFK meme or something? Uh, I don't really know. I, I don't know. Uh, greatest country in the world. Country with rocket dicks in space or country with universal healthcare. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Greatest country in the world, man. Man, we just like the show goes and shit, we just like. Eat McDonald's and like Waterburger all day. Like, oh my god, bro. Oh no, it's all good, bro. Don't be sitting eat my night 40, but it's all good, man. Man, man, man. Trade off for me. Just subscribe and I give you American stereotype memes. I am American, so it's all good. It's all good. Thank you. When you tell a self deprecating joke, but no one laughs. Laughs nervously. God, I wish I was dead. <laughs> Yo, yeah. you know how- Oh shit, this is a meme. The other meme, right, was like, bro, no relatability, nor is it funny. This meme hits both shit. Bro, th that hit hard, bro, the relatability. And bro, that was funny. That was a funny meme. I enjoyed it. Okay, you know how I said earlier, right? You know how I said earlier, uh, you know, memes and all that? Like, I have PG memes, right? PG memes? I'll give you- I'll give you the fruit. I mean, I'll give you the definition of what of what a good meme is because I'm a qualified meme expert right here. Meme expert, hair, show the PhD. It's all good. Basically, what makes a meme good is two things. Like I said earlier, re re relatability and if the punchline is actually good or not. This meme, right? Self-deprecating joke, but no one laughs. That's, that's the relatability part, because I myself am a depressed person who loves talking shit to myself. I'm like, Austin, you're so pretty, you're so, so, you're so fucking stupid. And then, and then I expect everybody to laugh, and then I was like, no, no, Austin, you're, you're fucking depressed. Like, and then I see this meme, I see this image, right, where this person looks kind of weird. It looks like she's dead inside, and that's kind of funny. All right, girls wearing matching outfit, fucking bitch. Guys wearing matching outfits. She can with best friends. Maybe this, maybe this is a public school thing, where there's like drama queens, but I, I, I go to a private channel on me. I know I'm gonna get bullied in the comments down below. I mean, I know I'm a rich guy, I know. I'm just kidding, I'm not rich. If I was rich, I could, you know, afford to like, play games on my fucking PC, but no, I can't. That's it, guys. Uh, I don't know how long this video's been, but I sure have talked the hell out of my ass. If you enjoyed this video, Please like and subscribe. I want to hit a thousand subscribers. If we can hit a thousand subscribers, I will. I will drink Mountain Dew. That's right, guys. I will drink Mountain Dew. I will drink so much Mountain Dew that you'll instantly be so impressed with my ability to drink Mountain Dew. That will be our subscriber special. You will get to watch me drink Mountain Dew, and you will be like, holy shit, awesome. That is amazing. Let's drink more Mountain Dew again. And I'd be like, fuck yeah, man. I'll drink, I'll, I'll do it again, but only if we hit two subs, two K subs, all right? But we're at a topic here, all right? If you want to see me drink Mountain Dew, then just hit the subscribe button. Honestly, it's not that hard. And hit the notification bell too, because if, uh, you know, you like the video, then of course, just, just for fuck's sake, just, just, just like it, bro. Like, sub, notification, or otherwise, you're fucking dead. Bye. No, that's not, that's not my bye.